Why is he looking for a non-target revive trap? So that I can special summon Kozaki from the graveyard without them disrupting it with DD Crow. Or... The other card. Kozaki. Sinet Storm. Imprudent Intrusion. Okay, let's see if it works. In Platinum. Can it beat over tier? We're about to find out. Can't they just shuffle Kozaki away anyway? They won't know I'm going for Kozaki though. They'll go for all the other cards I have in my graveyard. Because you hate it. Nice logs. Okay. Hello there. I am the nicest person who's ever lived. Oh no, I just drew into three Dynamishkuses. This is terrible. Why is it that bad things only ever happen to me? Well, let's see how well this works. 10 out of 10 hand. I agree, Gustav 1. Give my child support dual logs. <gasps> Thanks for the sub, Demon Head 431. Ooh, ooh, they're gonna go into Dragon Rulers. This is gonna be fun. The W for sure. We're going for nothing but Ws today. Dynamishkus isn't hard once per turn. You can set multiples. I can, but I want them in my hand. <gasps> your opponent has summoned a card. Would you like to activate the effect of a card? No. How's your day going? The awesome and kind-hearted logs? My day is fine. It's going good. I should probably ask Meowie how she's doing. Ugh. <gasps> Ooh. Thanks for the prime sub, Demon Head. I mean, what is it? FGC. And also the resub, Demon Head 431. Give my child support to logs. Demon Head? Who's your child? The Pile Arm Dragon. Here's to 14 months of lurking. Holy shit. How many messages do you have, Kendall Slice? Only 15 messages in 14 months? Damn, that's awesome. Whoa, that is a lot of attack points. Are they gonna go for a game? You're getting Tomahawked? I mean, I have disruption for Tomahawk. That's what I was waiting for. Battle phase? They're just gonna go for it? Well, I guess I can't wait. Time to banish Pile Arm Dragon. They are a super fan? Seems like it. <gasps> How's it going? Select a card to discard from your hand. I can bring out Lord of the Heavenly Prison. That seems like such a waste of the card though, because I just drew into it. Serious business? I love serious business. They can only attack with one monster now. Was that because of the pile arm dragon? I still have Max C going, so if they keep special summoning. Predator plant Verte Anaconda? Yes, I'll draw another card. <gasps> Ooh, I can use Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood in order to gain some life points. Oh, they hadn't even used Tempest yet. Yes, I would like to chain Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood to start getting some life points too. Are they going to go into DPE? Most likely. If they do, that means I can't use Sign at Storm because it'll just get popped. Ooh, Titano Cider. That will shut down DPE. Maxi at home. <laughs> I also have Maxi. Verte Anaconda, come on, give me some more card draw and life points, please. Is it just me or does Log sound differently? Yes, I'm the nicest person ever right now. DPE, they're gonna go for Denier and Dasher. No Celeste. Ooh, I drew into another one. Excellent. Card destruction? <gasps> okay, still a good hand. Give Mr. Metal a raise. Thanks for the 100 bits, Jupiter Spider. Yeah, I sure can't give Mr. Metal a raise. And also, I am a VTuber. Ooh, Pot of Extravagance. Okay, let's activate this immediately to draw some cards. Rip Sinet Storm. I can just get another one, especially if I draw some cards. Wait, they're going to activate DPE right now? Do they have a set scythe? <gasps> DPE? DPE? Oh my god, they did have a set scythe. How hilarious. I can't special summon this turn anyway. They hard drew into scythe. Oh, I forgot what the extravagance. Yep, I did. That's fine. I have so many cards in my hand anyway. It doesn't even matter. Let's see here. Triple Tactics Talent. Ooh. And then I can tribute it. Activate Triple Tactics Talent. Take control of one of your opponent's cards. Yes. I will take this DPE. Wait, what? A hard once per turn resets on my side of the field? Ooh, I didn't know that. Activate Monster Reborn. Let's bring back Predator Plant Verte Anaconda. I might be able to go into a Link 3 with these. Chain DPE? Oh wait, I can't because I'm Scythe Lock this turn. No, it's fine. This is my original plan anyway. Destroy the back row? Oh yeah, I forgot to do that. <laughs> Let's see, this card will get returned to the hand, so it doesn't really matter. 
Thank God the game keeps track of obscure Yu-Gi-Oh rules. Wait, what obscure Yu-Gi-Oh rules? Okay, we'll set two cards and pass. And I have Maxi. I'm not sure why they card destructioned my hand. It's a hard once per turn, but not a once per turn. Yeah, it reset. I just forgot to use it. Dash. <gasps> Ooh, Maxi again. Like getting DP stolen after activating. Do you think they have a uh, called by? I don't know what their set card is, but they're not using it. Ooh, a Cynet Storm! Standby phase, main phase one. Ooh, is this a tuner? It is. They can go into a level six. Denier, special summon this card. <gasps> Spooky Dogwood! Your opponent has exceeded in special summon. Activate the effect of a card. Yes, Spooky Dogwood. If they keep special summoning, then I gained a bunch of life points. <laughs> they're gonna go for it. They're gonna give me more card draw and more life points now. What does Cyanet Storm do? If I take more than 2,000 points of damage, I get to cheat out a Cypress monster for my extra deck. So I just normal summon Giant Kozaki to do that. What cards do I have left? Some good ones. Okay, what are you going to do next? Celestial can definitely come back in tier format. Oh yeah, because I can just shuffle it back. I'd rather it not though, because we still have DP, I mean, Predator Plant and Verte Anaconda. <gasps> IP Mascarina. Ooh, activate Titano Cider in the graveyard? Yes, please. There we go. This is only during the main phase, right? So as long as I use Titano Cider during my opponent's turn, I don't have to worry about it. Actually, no, you cannot depend on the situation. You cannot use the effect of Mirror Jade on your next turn, but you still the same turn quick effect is used. You can use it yourself afterwards. My DP gone and I'm ham boned. Are they going to go into Underworld Goddess? Oh, so they're going to try to go into Avermax. Artifact Dagda. Well, I guess they can just go into Avermax. But I can go into Avermax too. Avermax, who can't be destroyed and cannot be targeted. Also, my monster was normal summoned, so Avermax's effect doesn't work. <laughs> I don't think they remember that. <laughs> I think I sh Oh, he remembered. He remembered at the right, the, the right second. The last second, I mean. He's like, uh-oh, never mind. It was normal summoned. It was a normal summon 3000 attack beat stick. Uh-oh, never mind. Nine cards. Should I draw? Should I use Pot of Extravagance? Honestly, my hand is freaking banger right now. Cynet Storm, Giant Kozaki. Take 2,000 points of damage. Activate Cynet Storm, Avermax. What happens when Avermax attacks into an Avermax? Chat. <laughs> Maxi won you this game? Of course it did. Okay, Avermax gets a shuffle. Who are they gonna shuffle? They're gonna shuffle my Avermax. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna use Pot of Prosperity. Banish three cards. One, two, three. Ariana. Ooh. Wait, I could use another lore to protect my back row, but I don't care about protecting my back row. I care about going into Ariana. Okay, and then we set Waking the Dragon. I don't need to pitch anything else for my deck. A normal summoned Lord of the Heavenly Prison is winning me this game right now. Ditching your extra deck and sign at Storm seems counterintuitive. I at most cheat out one or two monsters from the extra deck. The other ones, and I also can only cheat them out randomly anyway. So my extra deck is a resource and I'm using it. Avermax wins. What do they even have left? They've used everything. They don't even have dragons in the graveyard to bring out Tempest again. No, they have one dragon in the graveyard. They'd have to use one in their hand too. Oh, rank seven. I have Titanociders. They're completely ham-boned. DBE gone, I'm ham-boned. Exactly. Okay, now it's time for Ariana. We'll use Ariana to ditch one of my Titano Ciders to the grave because I don't need both of them. Special summon Giant Kozaki from the deck. He gets destroyed immediately, which triggers Cynet Storm. <gasps> what am I getting? Ooh, Spectrum. Spectrum Supreme. All right, let's go into the battle phase and win this. Wouldn't it be funny if they had a mirror force? This is such a funny combo. <laughs> Mech Knight Gamer Supreme. I didn't even need it. All I needed was the normal summon Ariana. Oh, it's not even your choice? It's just a random dude from the extra deck? Yeah, exactly. It's just a random card from the extra deck. That's why I can use my extra deck as a resource. How can you make a deck so funny? This deck is hilarious. The win condition is actually to bring out Kozaki. Gonna go buy out giant Kozaki. Why not Boral End? Who's Boral End? I'm copying this deck. 
I'll post it in the... Someone remind me to post it in the deck description afterwards. Six cards. 3,500 towers. It has to be Cybers. Ooh. Not half bad. Spooky Dogwood and Maxi. And if they pop my back row, I can just chain a... a, um, a uh, what should we call it? Waking the dragon. What are they gonna do? They're going to send Foolish Burial, a tier. Are they actually playing tier limits? A rainbow bridge? <gasps> it's a tier limit. Oh my god, I get to summon a more billion of monsters. It's gonna mill from both decks. I don't really have graveyard effects other than Titano Cider. The scoop logs? Did they not mill anything? No, they milled two tier names. And a shuffler. Ooh. Time to chain spooky sister, ghost sister, and the spooky dogwood. I was not paying attention. How do you summon Avermax, the last duel, just activate signed at Storm? How do you take 2,000 damage? I took 2,000 damage by summoning Giant Kozaki, or I took 2,500 points of damage, actually. He immediately destroys himself, which is very useful for taking a whole bunch of points of damage. And Maxi. I see them in silver. Tier limits should be everywhere. <gasps> Ooh, they both resolved. Spooky Dogwood. Come on, draw me a whole bunch of cards. And gave me a bunch of life points. 1,500 life points. YouTube by Giant Kozaki. Do it. This is the deck is a well-oiled machine. Oh. Kaleidohard. Ooh, they get to spin one of my cards. Which one are they spinning? That one? Cool, let's activate it in response. Targeting this card. Let's get rid of Kaleidohard. Okay, Kaleidohard, pitch Dynamishkis. And it goes to the grave, it doesn't even get spun. <laughs> Hazukashi. Tier Elements Scream. Are they gonna summon out? Wait, why did they activate this now, not earlier? Yeah, get banished. No floating for you. If this card is sent to the graveyard by card effect, special summon this card. And if you do summon Tier Elements card from your deck to the graveyard. Okay, wait, how come Titano Signer didn't trigger? Except the turn it was sent to the graveyard. Oh, okay. Uh, the only card I have in my deck that I can search with this one currently is a Titano Cider or Waking the Dragon. So I think I'm going to use it now to get out Titano Cider. Titano Cider. <gasps> chain a card? Ooh, I can chain Dynamishkis. Do I need to chain Dynamishkis? There's no reason not to. Especially if they waste one of their uh, shufflers on this. Tier can't out Avermax, right? They are going to waste a shuffler on it. You absolute buffoon. I don't even need it. Yes, please put it back in my deck so I can use it again. <laughs> I'm begging you. Put that card back in my deck. I would rather get one of those out than a Titano Cider. <gasps> Both of them? Ooh. You just got jebated, you absolute buffoon. <laughs> Dynamishkis. Thank you. <gasps> I should play Karma Cut. I think Karma Cut would be awesome in this deck. Ooh, I drew into Titano Cider anyway. Lucky me. Okay, we'll activate. Oh my god, I only had one Sinet Storm left in my deck. The other ones were milled? Oh my god. If this gets destroyed, I'm hand-boned. Sinet Storm resolves? I think it's just asking them if they want to use their shufflers. Kozaki! Immediately gets destroyed. I take 2,500 points of damage. <laughs> Activate Sinet Storm? Yes. Which card am I going to get today? It's time for the Sinet Storm roulette. If they activate... A card. I can use Triple Tactics Talents to draw two more cards. So I would love it if they shuffled something back. I think they're just reading the effect right now. <gasps> Maxi! That means I can use Triple Tactics Talent. I'm literally only going to summon one time this turn. And that's it. Come on. Ooh, Avermax. You have to remember, if he's not summoned properly, he doesn't have protection. So he can be targeted. Okay. And now I get to draw two cards. You absolute buffoon. Thanks for activating Maxi, you idiot. You moron. Ooh, another Kozaki for next turn. We'll put this one right there, right here, and then we'll attack respectfully. Say triple tactic talents three times really fast. I don't think I want to. <laughs> I have two forms of disruption against them. If they bring out Kaleido Heart, I can Titano Cider it. Or if they bring out... Actually, I think this one's better on, uh, yeah, Kaleido Heart. And then Pelos like down to Mishkas is better on Kit Kalos. There won't be a next turn. There will absolutely be a next turn. <gasps> Merely! That's gonna mill three cards. Let's see, I have Giant Kozaki in my hand. And then Scream will allow them to mill another three cards. I forgot Instant Fusion and Terraforming. Ooh, they milled three different tier names, as well as Cry. Target a banished tier limit monster, add it to your hand. They get to reset one of their Kaleido Hearts, which doesn't really do anything. They could have just reset Rhino Heart. What a waste. Unless they're only playing one copy of Kaleido Heart. But it says summon from the extra deck. Does it go through? When this card is linked summon... When this linked summon card is on the field, your opponent cannot target this card with card effects. 
Nope, it was not Link Summoned. It was Special Summoned from the Extra Deck. That's true, but it wasn't Link Summoned. It was Special Summoned. Three Rhino, two, three Scream at Standard. What are they going to go into? Kit Kalos? Most don't run Diviner. <gasps> it's Kit Kalos. And then Shireen. What do you mean, guys? The tears are semied. What are they going for next? Rakulos. Activate Titanocide in your graveyard? Hell yeah, I will. Chat going crazy and ratios are already solved. Exactly. I'm surprised they didn't go into Rhino Heart. Ooh, they're going to waste one of their shufflers on it. You absolute buffoon. I don't even need it in the field because I already have it on the field. They're so afraid of Titano Cider. You know, maybe I could also play Backjack in this deck. I don't really mill very much with this deck, but my opponent definitely mills my deck. They're going to reset some of their resources. Go for it. Okay, Titano Cider's gone. The only effect I have of, of Avermax is the one where it has an honest effect when it attacks. This guy is a battling machine right now, but that's the only thing he's good at, is battling. Sprite Elf? Wait, what? Why do you go into Sprite Elf? Neko Main King? Oh yeah, I guess that's another counter to this, but I'm not really going against that many tiers. Target one monster in your graveyard. I guess I can just use Titano Cider now to shut down this Sprite Elf on the field. He wants to make Barone? How's he going to make Barone with this? Does he have any shufflers left? He has two shufflers left. Holy shit. His graveyard is full of shufflers. Could you stop shuffling, getting shufflers in the graveyard? That would be excellent. Battle phase. <gasps> End phase. Funny thing is, Titanocider's negate is permanent. He's just a sitting duck on the field now. If he activates his effect, then my triple tactics talent's gonna go burr. Hmm. Actually, give me a second. If I summon Arion and summon Giant Kozaki by ditching Dynamishkus, then I can win this turn. Surrendered? Do it. I was going to, but my opponent surrendered before I could finish. Does Sinet Storm work if your uh, Link Zone is filled? Um, it's still procs, but it won't like summon anything if you don't have any Link Arrows. I hate Runic. I love going against Runic when I have Shufflers. The Shizu Shufflers completely dunk all over Runics. They can't do anything versus those Shufflers. The problem is he kept using Dispelling. <laughs> if he didn't use Dispelling on me twice, I would have been able to use my Field Spell. But he kept Dispelling me. Chandelier. Ooh, oh my god, non-fusion area. It must mean they have another non-fusion area. I only play Link monsters, though. Neither player can fusion summon. <coughs> Welcome, Labyrinth. Cool. New card. <gasps> Titano Cider. Welcome, Labyrinth. The special summon. This deck doesn't really special summon that much. Anymore. Waking is so good versus Labyrinth. Is it? Do they pop my back row? I'll just set a single Waking the Dragon, then, and gain some life points. Ooh, they went with the big one. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We'll set one Waking the Dragon and pass. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. It's main phase only? Why? Why are you so bad? <laughs> Each time your opponent special summons during the main phase or battle phase, gain life points equal to the monster's attack. This is why Spooky Dogwood kind of sucks. Welcome Labyrinth for another one. <gasps> Ariana. Well, you would assume it's both main phases. No, I activated during the draw phase. Stovey. Paleozoic Marella. The field spell. And then Compulse to bounce the card back. Marella to come out. Hopefully they destroy... No, they can't destroy anything. Okay. <gasps> oh, and now they can do something. They can just destroy a card from my hand. Oh no! Chandelier back to the hand. And then destroy a random card in- What? Why did they destroy my middle card? God damn it. They tested it and they knew it was safe to not destroy. Labyrinth, Labyrinth. Maybe they'll activate Welcome Labyrinth and destroy it. Do they even have another Welcome Labyrinth? They got hit off the field with it already. They have no idea I'm playing Waking the Dragon. They just know that it's safe to attack while it's face down. Ooh, is that you, Joe Friendship? <gasps> Welcome Labyrinth. Oh, I can't activate cards in response to it, so no spooky dog wooden. He can, however, destroy my Waking the Dragon now. 
And then Stovey sets another one. Activate Waking the Dragon. Should I also activate Spooky Wood? Yes, so they can't do anything else. Say that to Maple, huh? Waking the Dragon. Okay, I get a special summon any monster from my deck. So this one right here can't be targeted or destroyed by my opponent's card effects and has 3,000 attack. That's probably the best one to bring out. Or Zeroboros, which doesn't really do anything unless they summon a card or I can summon a card. <gasps> or this one. Send one. All monsters once per battle. If this card battles once monster, you can send an earth monster from your hand or graveyard. So then the monster loses to attack. Also, negates effects. When you activate a card or effect that targets a link monster you control, you can negate the effect. And if you do destroy that card, <gasps> I can bring out this card and it forces all other monsters to attack mine this turn. No raid raptor? Nope. Ariana. They're going to send a card to the graveyard. Wait, if they go into Baguska, then they can prevent their cards from having to attack this turn. A chandelier. Hopefully they don't have something amazing to get rid of this card. What are they going to do? They're fiend locked. Their options are very limited. Compulse? I can negate cards that target it. Compulse won't work. They need to non-target destroy it, which they can do with Labyrinth. Labyrinth. But not this turn because they already used Welcome Labyrinth. They're hand boned. They have to attack into it. All monsters your opponent controls must attack this card if able. Two compulses? Another compulse won't work. When your opponent activates a card or effect that targets a link monsters you control, quick effect, you can negate the effect, and if you do destroy that card, you can lose each effect once per turn. I have a once per turn stop. He would need two cards. I know one of his set cards is a welcome labyrinth. The other one, if it targets, I'm ham boned. Most of their stuff targets. Not all of it though. They do have, you know, obviously their field spell, which doesn't target. Cerberus. I have a monster in the extra monster zone. That doesn't work. You buffoon. You'd have to go into Nightmare Unicorn. Unless he's just trying to get more monsters in the graveyard so he can go into, uh... There's Unicorn! You absolute buffoon! Targeting my golem. Activate golem. However, now if they have a compulse, they can get rid of it. <gasps> Do they have a compulse set? They quit! Oh my god! All they had to do was attack and they would have won! But they just had to be greedy. Look, they're even playing the Ishuzu Shufflers. <gasps> they're playing Yujo Friendship and and um, Unity so they can play Judgment of the Pharaoh. How the turns have tabled. That's 